Is the house or condominium plumbed with hot water? And coming from North America, I think many of us would scratch our heads and go, hmm, of course it is. But see, we don't know what we don't know. And what we don't know is this. We don't know that in many cases, only the master bedroom will actually have hot and cold water running to it. The guest bedrooms, the maids rooms, uh, even the kitchen uh, has one single water pipe, a cold water pipe running to the faucets. And because of that, we don't check. So we get excited, we fall in love with a beautiful home at the beach or a condo or something like that. And then we, now we own it and we come back and we, uh, yeah, in our master bedroom, we've got it. And then maybe our in-laws or our kids come by or our grandkids come and gosh, there's no hot water in the bathroom, grandpa or whatever. And, and my goodness, how do you fix that after the fact? It's hard to fix it after. Can you? Yes. You can put in the Insta water heaters. You have to bust out concrete because most things in this part of the world are built out of concrete. It's expensive. It's inconvenient. Um, it's just better to make sure that your home or condominium actually has two pipes running to every bathroom so that you have hot and cold running water. In fact, we have a great picture. Uh, the picture is uh, uh, where they've run a Y adapter out of the wall up to the hot and cold water taps. And so, you know, and again, if you were just reading this without seeing the picture, you might think to yourself, okay, yeah, I walk into the bathroom, I turn on one side, and there's water, I turn it off, I turn on the other side, put my hand under it on the hot side, and you'd say to yourself, hmm, yeah, that water heater's way over there by the garage. Ah, what, I'm not gonna stand here for two, three minutes and let this water get hot. Well, the reality is you could stand there for two or three minutes, two or three weeks, two or three years. As you see in the picture, that water's never getting hot. So again, the only way we know that there's hot and cold running water in a bathroom is to actually get down on our hands and knees and look under the sink and see if you've got two pipes coming out of the wall. We as North Americans would not think to do that nine times out of 10. Again, we don't know what we don't know. So here are the questions. So let's go on to the next question.